What's up, everybody? Kimberly Olson back here. I wanted to do a live to save it for IGTV, and I forgot to hit save because I was so flustered about the guy who came to the door. If you guys didn't watch it, go back and watch it. It was really, really funny. So remind me at the end, just somebody met to her again because the internet is not working. You guys just saw the behind the scenes in my office. Isn't that fun? Okay, so we'll find some more fun in my house for you guys to check out. Okay, so we're going to talk about the weekend. How fun is that? So one of the things I've noticed is that people will think that, okay, this is why Mondays don't work. This, this is what I'm going to tell you. Because I've been doing nutrition consulting for a really long time. And there are so many people who say, I will wait until Monday, right? Like that's a normal thing to do. And it doesn't work. And this is why. Because there are seven days in the week, right? So usually what I've noticed is people will start checking out around Thursday. Thursday after work. They're like, okay, I'm so tired. Like Thursday, right? Or if you work Friday, you're like, okay, what's going on Friday evening? So basically Friday, Saturday, and Sunday are out. Whether it comes to healthy eating, exercise, it's like you know, freaking drinking and eating and partying. And it might even be Netflix binging, you know, it doesn't have to be, you know, the party scene. And what happens is we think we can start on Monday, right? Well, what we do to ourselves is we don't realize there are seven days in the week. We've just taken three of the seven. You guys, that's like 40% of the week is gone. That's almost half of your time. So what we do is we start on Monday and we're already behind the eight ball. And then we're feeling it. Like even if you think, oh, it's Monday and I'm so excited, subconsciously, <coughs> <coughs> subconsciously, you know that you're behind the eight ball and you know that you set goals for yourself for the month and you didn't do them. So you're already kind of having that icky feeling and you don't have that excitement and motivation and Monday comes and then you're just not like rocking it like you thought you were gonna do and it's this vicious cycle. So what I'm gonna challenge you guys to do is to treat every day as important weekends included okay so if you want to watch a movie friday night like scott and i always watch a movie every friday night awesome go watch a movie friday night but then go spend a little time on your business stay up a little bit later you're gonna be okay all right saturday and sunday you guys you gotta be hustling if you want to make six figures if you want to quit your job if you want to really have your own business you have got to hustle and that is a seven days a week giving up the stuff you love for a little bit think of it as startup mode when people are in a startup they are in a real startup you know, I hear stories of people who, when they were starting up their company, they took, they were at their office for so long that they would sleep there. And both of them, like there was these two dudes that started this huge company. They slept in their office. They didn't even have an apartment. They would shower at the gym because they were there all the time working. They would take turns. One would be coding at night. The other would be doing sales during the day, right? So you got to think about it that way. You're in startup mode. You got to hustle, okay? You got to hustle. You got to work hard. So I'm going to challenge you. Work every day on your business. And if you're like, well, I have, I have to have a sabbatical on Sundays, great. Knock yourself out. But you need to stay intentional and you need to just work it, work it, work it because it will pay off and you're going to get that momentum. If you take Friday, Saturday, Sunday off, wait till Monday, you've broken your momentum and you're starting over. And I know how frustrating that can be, okay? So I'm going to make this short and sweet just because everything's been a little wonky with the internet and stuff like that. And I'm going to remember to save it. But I'm the Gold Digger Girl, so you can find me all over social media at the Gold Digger Girl, also known as as a gold digger girl. My name is Kimberly Olson. And also right now what I have coming up is I have a personal branding work. I also have a, my mastermind is open. If you're not my mastermind, you have to get my mastermind. It is the most incredible group of women. You get private coaching from me and it's like people who are ready to crush it. It is open now. So message me for the application or you can go to my website, thegolddiggergirl.com. Thanks for watching. Have a good one and have a great weekend too. Bye.